Hi, I'm Peter Graves, Managing Director for UiPath in Australia and New Zealand. The latest research from IDC reveals that over 90% of organisations are adopting or planning to adopt some form of agentic AI. The industry is moving very fast. There's lots of noise and lots of confusion about where to make strategic investments. Uh, something that I thought would be interesting to do today is, is reflect on what we've seen over the last 12 months, coming into December, Christmas, it's always a good time for reflection. Uh, and there's some really key things that, that have stood out to us this year in relation to how our customers and the industry in general are adopting agentic AI. The first is governance and trust. We've noticed that our customers that have spent the time to invest in the framework and foundation, um, build the guardrails for the use of AI and agentic in their organisations, are moving the fastest and seeing the rewards the quickest. I think that's the number one thing that I would stress. Spend the time to get the foundations right and then move that pace. Learn quickly, fail fast, and be able to iterate and stay, stay agile. The next is where the, where the focus has been. 12 months ago, it was all about uh, small pilots, small POCs, uh, what can we do quickly? Uh, we've seen that change in the last six months. It's really about how do I drive real value? How do I get agentic processes into production uh, and start scaling this out and driving real change across the organization? Um, so that I think will continue uh, and will probably increase. Uh, and the third is, uh, I think I mentioned it before, but just staying agile, staying open, having the right partners and the right ecosystem that, that let you access the best um, and access thought leadership from other parts of the world. Um, I don't think anyone has all the answers at the moment. So it is about leaning on your ecosystem partners and you know, asking for help. Uh, and that's what UiPath is here to do. Uh, we're an agentic automation platform and you know, serve over 400 customers in Australia and New Zealand. And uh, we're very excited about the opportunities ahead of us in the, in the local market. Thank you.